Uh, my name is Tony Lin, I'm from Jester Wiles Architects, the architects for the National Graphene Institute. And we're here in, in uh, Manchester, and having a tour with Physics World of the building. Uh, this is a building that's just recently finished, and it's a 61 million pound facility designed for the collaborative efforts between the academics at Manchester and industry partners for the development of commercial applications of graphene. So the building has a, a number of different uh, uh, facilities, uh, the clean rooms of course, uh, but also different kinds of labs, chemistry labs, materials, uh, optical labs and so on, in order to allow uh, the, the research to take any directions that it could possibly uh, take uh, in the coming years. So as you can see uh, behind me there uh, is, is the main clean room at the, at the lower ground floor level and surrounding this clean room on two sides is um, uh, what we call a, a, a viewing corridor and that allows people to walk and, uh, and tour, have a tour of the clean room uh, without actually having to gown up and go in which is a complicated process. So it actually has two, two skins this building, there is an inner skin which is uh, relatively straightforward, uh, insulated, high-performing, uh, insulated metal panel. And then on the outside of that, there is this very thin uh, black stainless, it's actually it's a stainless steel panel, which uh, wraps around the whole building. On the uh, panels themselves, the perforated panels, there is actually inscripted um, uh, the formulas uh, used by Costia in the, in the work in graphene. The laboratories are mainly located on two floors and they're designed in such a way that they're fully integrated with the right up in office space on each floor so that the building can be divided up into different teams, different teams could move into different areas of the building and work in a totally flexible way.